let us try to find out the equivalent resistance of the circuit okay so find equivalent resistance and and you should be able to figure out which elements are in series and which in parallel right now now you you can see that that if, if this point is is named it has a potential va and this point a potential vb then the same potential va gets applied across this and a vb comes here and a va comes here and a vb comes here right so so the same potential va minus vb appears across them and hence they are in parallel right so so and and i had told you to 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 be using r is equal to the the product upon the sum as the formula okay instead of the conventional one that we had derived and, and that makes it 6 into 3 upon 6 plus 3 which is nothing but 18 upon 9 18 upon 9 which is nothing but 2 right so the equivalent resistance of this is is 2 okay fine that means this across this terminal you can replace it by 2 as well correct so so let us do that okay so i'll erase this i'll erase this and between this i'll i'll attach a a, a, a 2 ohm resistance right so so I'll erase this, okay, and across it I'll I'll attach a two ohm resistance. So, so this is what equivalence means. So this is two ohms, right? This is two. Now, if you look at it, the current that travels from here goes here comes here and has no way of getting diverted it is forced to flow through all of them the same current the moment we see the same current flowing through all of the resistors they are in series okay they are in series so 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 now we apply the equivalent resistance r equivalent is equal to 5 okay and, and and when that happens the equivalent resistance becomes the sum of the individual resistors so 5 plus 4 plus 2 plus 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 2 and that gives you 30 ohms now based on this i can ask you i can ask you to to calculate the total current that this whole circuit is drawing from the cell and what is that I have my equivalent resistance equal to 30 right so so let me draw that circuit so equivalent resistance is 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 30 okay so so it looks something like that That. this is closed fine so it is it is as if as if as 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 far as the current drawn is concerned it is as if this is 10 volts and this is 30 volts that is all now what does that become what does that become what does that become it, it tells me that that the that the current i is nothing but what 10 upon 30 amperes right this is the current in the circuit fine it can further be complicated 
it can be further complicated that we see in the next how how in what ratio does a current divide between two parallel elements right we will we'll see that